Hi and welcome to the sixth video on seven ways to get out of your comfort zone and this one is do some public speaking or even scarier for me at least some public singing and most people are thought to be scared of speaking in public in front of a crowd it's often cited that it's actually scarier for most people than the fear of dying so it's it's quite high up on the list of things that is best outside your comfort zone and quite often way off the score in terms of outside the comfort zone so if you're scared of public speaking take the opportunity do it it's actually once you do it once or twice it can get quite addictive and you might find yourself almost being a bore with it but don't 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 go to that extent just do to the extent of just even in front of a small group and what you find is that concentrate just on one person rather than everyone don't stare at them that just looks weird but as though you're speaking on one-to-one -one, but just happens to be a larger group in front of you and remember that most people won't be paying an awful lot of attention they'll be thinking about other things maybe they'll be clicking around on their iPhone or their Android or whatever it happens to be and they certainly won't be paying as much attention as you think they are but it's a fun thing to do and if you're comfortable with public speaking or if the idea of public speaking is actually too much do some public singing instead there's probably karaoke near you or it could be an open mic session or if you're feeling really adventurous, busking, uh, obviously subject to local bylaws and little things like that. But anything like that, karaoke, keep in mind you probably won't be the worst person on stage that evening. And as the evening goes on, especially if it's a bar, the competence of the singers is not necessarily going to improve. So it's fine. Open mic, again, people will be quite happy that you just turned up, usually. And you'll get an idea of the atmosphere, just go along and be one of the audience the first once or twice. And then if you think that's something you can do, or think that's something you can push yourself to do, give it a go. So public speaking or public singing, really good ways, or both of them, really good ways to get outside your comfort zone.